I read the news every day, or almost every day. And like you, sometimes I take encouragement from the news and other times it just wears me out. But to tell you the truth, I'm tired of people screwing around with the medical news. It's driving me crazy. There was a story this morning about this beautiful young woman who, um, she was zip lining in uh, a camp and she went into some water and she cut her leg. And as a result, they're saying that she may die of flesh eating bacteria. Um, that she may die is true and that's tragic. I, I understand that and I, I feel sorry for her and I actually did pray about her. But the idea that they use terms like flesh eating bacteria this is nothing new. This has been going on forever. The girl went to the emergency room and they cleaned her up and stapled up her leg. And she had in some way that injury, that bacteria got in there and it created a problem that didn't heal. She's one out of uh, 310, 20 million people in the United States and she had a bad injury and now she has a very bad infection. They call it flesh eating bacteria, which might make you just entirely freak out. The same thing with MRSA or methicillin resistant staph and superbugs. Certainly there's some problems and antibiotics are way overused. But I think when we use inflammatory terminology like flesh-eating bacteria, we're screwing with people's minds and we shouldn't do it. What we should talk about is that taking good care of yourself and keeping your immune system strong, putting the control and power back in your hands is where the value is. That doctor in the emergency room probably did a great job. It may not have been the exactly right thing to do. I don't know I wasn't there. I won't second guess him. Does she have flesh-eating bacteria? I don't know about that. She has a bacteria that may take her life, and that's tragic. More tragic is to create a gigantic wave of hysteria that causes people to be entirely panicked about cutting their leg in a river or in a lake while they're on vacation this year. Take care of yourself, build up your immune system. If you have a problem, go see your doctor and he'll probably do a great job. So. We're better together and don't freak out about flesh-eating bacteria.